we're tired, but we're done. So, you know, of course your spirits lift at that point. Also, I'm on a rolling chair. So we were saying we should have brought these first. Then we could have sat in them while we moved boxes. Okay. Hey everybody, welcome to another day with the Norps. It's a big day because we've got this thing in our driveway. We're officially doing phase one of our move, which is move into the utility building. So because the house is so small right now and also because it's still under construction, we're moving almost everything into that utility building except for bare essentials. Bare essentials? Anyways, so we're moving in and uh, got everybody moving boxes I just pulled in and uh, we're going to try to get as much as we can over today. Ah, well, you don't have to work got it? Here they know. What? No. Good job. Ah. You got Go it. Asher. It's books, but you can do it. Yeah. Fill this whole thing. this room because this is where Daniel is doing all his missionary training work so he needs to get started here so we've got pretty much everything out and uh, this will be our kitchen table at the other house I still haven't figured out what chairs we'll be using somebody gave this to us and uh, I painted the chairs but um, they were kind of broken anyways okay. we'll see what ends up They're happening and now we're just gonna keep moving boxes out. Mike asked me to film, if you're wondering why I'm filming and not helping. Um, Eve's gotta take a drink break. But, okay, so now I'm gonna get going. Oh, so these, these two are still working on this box. <laughs> Have you taken some breaks or something? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that looks a little, Pearl, you gotta look at your feet. There you go. You made it. Did I ring tape the top? Um, I think it's okay. Okay. What's in there? I'm not sure, but it's kind of heavy. Hmm. Okay. We'll have to put that in a box. Taking a break. What you doing? Okay, then help. You can't help if you're just sitting there. Okay, then help Jude. Hey, Mom, can I put this in there? Um, yeah, that's fine. Okay. most of the things that we're going to put move for right now from the inside the house but now we have this workshop and um, not too much space left in the truck so we'll probably be doing a second trip but right now we're just trying to get some legs off of furniture so it can go in easier and, uh, and then I think once we get this packed rest away we'll probably have a lunch break all right we've gotten this far it's just about full. We can't, I don't have a lot more stuff we can stack on top right now. Although we still have a lot more stuff to move, but we're all taking a lunch break now. So we picked like the hottest day of the summer so far to do this. So it is pretty hot. 
Okay. All right, lunch break. What? Try to put it in the bottom. Everyone is tired. They won't be Okay, we just got the word that Daniel just got his reassignment. I got the text because his number wasn't working when they tried to send him. The mom's going to tell him. You got reassignment. Where? Late in Utah. Utah? Late in Utah. I'm Jean Stitt. No, no, no. I, I would only say it's like, I'm going to get raised on to Utah. And I got raised on to Utah. I guess you just knew. Where would they? No, it says, it says June 30th. week of June 30th. I I'm not sure. That's that's all he said. Oh, man. Okay. That's crazy. All right. That's happening. What month is it? That's in eight <laughs> days. I got reassigned to late in Utah. Ooh, look at those snakes. That's awesome. All right, we're loaded up as much as we can right now. Don't really have any more boxes I can put in, and I can't, I'm not gonna stack furniture on top of furniture, so. Um, we're going in three different cars. We're gonna go unload. Okay, we got to the warehouse, and a few of us are just sweeping up because there's a lot of cobwebs, um, which makes me a little nervous, but also, I don't want to keep feeling nervous every time I go to the shelf. So we're sweeping up, and then we're going to, and some, Andrew over there is bringing some boxes in, and we'll unload the truck. Truck is pretty much un unloaded, but now we're kind of organizing because a lot of the stuff is actually going to end up back over the house, and so we don't want it to be a complete mess, which it kind of is right now. So we've got some different piles we're doing with different locations that they'll eventually go in the house. Kind of a tedious process. Okay. All right, um, we're back at the house again. Sweet. It's round two. I'm trying to get the rest of the random stuff that's in here, workbenches and whatnot. It's kind of a little, it's a little overwhelming, but we're just gonna keep chipping away at it. It's a lot to do. Okay, I think we've loaded up as much as we can. We're all exhausted. This heat is killing us, but we're gonna get this last load over and then we'll be done with moving for today. We're here, it's the last load. This is the least fun I've had with a move like this. I know, it's been really hard. It's. I think it's because usually you have the momentum and the excitement of the new adventure and, then, and what we just have to look forward to is two more weeks of renovations and more work yeah more and, work and you're not getting like anything new and shiny yeah i haven't felt as excited small and dirty <laughs> <laughs> big and dirty this well, thing i mean even at the house yeah mm -hmm. well and also we, we just have been working work. so hard already I know, they were like, renovating. Kind of drained. And it's, it was 90 degrees today yeah, with really like 300% humidity. And inside that truck was like 1,000 degrees. <sighs> so I've, I've actually been exhausted from the first thing I picked I up. Oh, me too. <laughs> so it's been, I think <laughs> the like, kids are maybe feeling the same way. I'll have it. But we haven't had any complaints from so the kids. I, I would like to have some donuts. Donuts will probably solve our problems, right? And ice cream. I know the kids have been really helpful. Ice Thank cream you. with donuts on top, or donuts with ice cream on top. Donuts with ice cream inside. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> maybe we'll get. Uh, well, maybe the kids will get a, a treat for helping out because they have been very helpful. Megan and I have not have been a little maybe short. Well, I've with... just been quiet. I think. Yeah. You could, I was just saying you've done really well today. Really? I think so. I feel like I've been a little bit short-tempered. I think we've both been very um, quiet, but I thought you've been, you, I think you've been actually really good. 
Oh, okay, I'll take that. Anyways, last load. It's always faster to unload than it is to load. And so we just gotta decide where stuff is going in here. Cause I'm actually kind of surprised how quickly it seems like we're running out of room. <laughs> Keep in mind, we're taking a 3,600 square foot house and putting it in a 1,600 square foot building, so. That's true. Um, anyhow, so yes, we have to decide. This is all actually, this is actually all garage stuff. Now this is stuff that so we actually are gonna work right with. Over here, right? So we decided the shop area will be kind of in the back. We have some shelving though that we need to decide on. Well, and remember also people, a lot of this will get over to the house. Yeah. So that's probably also part of the exhaustion is you know you're moving it in here and then like you're moving it over there. It'll, that'll be a slower process I'm hoping. Yeah. Well, actually, I'm not sure if I hope that or not. Yeah. We got like piles of boxes for like different, like I think girls. this is the girls stuff and this is the boys stuff and that stuff that's actually just kind of staying in, in um, storage this is books and more books and i think kitchen stuff yeah, here this is decorator yeah. items and like pillows kitchen stuff is here and over here oh geez okay all right well let's let's we'll talk about it okay Whew, truck is empty swept it out we need to put the uh let's put the dolly back in it and uh, we should be good to go. I'm actually gonna run it back while these guys finish up here because the truck is due back in a half hour, so I gotta get going. Uh, we're okay. Okay, we're done. Whoa! Whoa! We're tired, but we're done. So you know, of course, your spirits lift at that point. Also, I'm on a rolling chair, so we were saying we should have brought these first. Then we could have sat in them while we moved boxes. <laughs> Not really. But um, maybe I'll send, are you up to go and pick up pizza? Sure. No, can we go to anyone? As long as I get to take my little car. Um, it's not a bad idea to go, I guess. We just have to go buy, no, because no, we can't because Daniel's doing MTC stuff. Okay. So, um, wait, you're gonna wait for dad to come back? Yeah, okay. Okay. So Mike is dropping off the truck and I've got my shop stuff here. Lots of pieces of furniture that I will hopefully get moved into the shop in the next few weeks, maybe. I don't know. Our dinner table, which looks even bigger in here, strangely enough. Um, the wood shop stuff, which we'll organize. And this is gonna be long-term storage. Andrew's desk, or probably anybody will be able to use it. Um, the kids will play D and D here, and then this is all just decorator stuff and books. So a lot of this stuff will go into the house once the house is ready for us. But we are ready to be done. So um, I guess we kind of need to wait though because Dad needs to lock up and stuff. So let's just take the trash cans to the curb. The house has air conditioning if we want to head over there. Yeah. Um, it's even though we're exhausted, I'm just walking around our yard and thinking about, it's kind of strange to own a place. It's been so long. We even owned our own house. I can't even think straight up, uh, five years, six years, six years. So it's like, I don't remember what that feels like, but I'm starting to, as I spend the day here and it's like, once this is done, it's just ours. And it's like, feels kind of quiet and private, you know, like, it's our place. Even if it's small, it's ours. And um, it's been a while since we felt that, you know, because I mean, the RV was ours, but we also always knew we'd probably sell that eventually. And then, you know, staying in all these Airbnbs and, and then renting a couple of houses. It's nice. We've been really looking forward to it again. Look at these beautiful trees. Love these. I'm just kind of waiting because Peter's been mowing the lawn which he's actually really excited about because you get paid for it and he wants money. So our property goes, that 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 is the neighbor's shed and it's right on the edge of the property. So it's much bigger than it might look like at first. It's kind of hard to tell because those trees are so big that if you don't see a person out there, you don't really. Sorry, got a call. So, feels so good to be done. There were really moments today where I thought, I can't do this. Esther and I were just talking about it. We started with the books. We think that might be why all of us had a really bad attitude because 
we were exhausted halfway through taking out all our books. And you think, we have just begun. But, um, and then, yeah, like I said, you don't have like the energy of the, in, of the excitement of the, the change to like m move you. Or even like the like deadline of like you have to be out because this is just like, we don't have to be out for another two and a half weeks, so. And uh, I imagine we're just gonna all collapse <laughs> at home. Snake. All right, dinner tonight is pizza. I like to say we don't. We only have pizza on the nights that you know we work really hard, but we did work really hard today. You be quiet. Boy, what did I say? Alexa. Alexa, stop it. So we're all eating, and it tastes good, right, Megan? Very good. We're hungry. We're tired. We're sweaty. Everybody, I think everyone's done. Yeah, that 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 um that shop. We did some serious sweeping and taking stuff out, and it got pretty dusty. So we're all a little bit grimy, and it started to get kind of windy out. It's a severe thunderstorm morning. They say that it might thunderstorm, so we'll see. We're happy to have pizza. Hey, we forgot to finish yesterday's video. But I don't know about you, I feel like waking up this morning, I feel way better than I felt for the last several days. Let's hope they do, right? Or are you talking to me or to them? I'm talking to you. Oh. <laughs> I don't know how they feel. Just because I didn't I didn't realize what a stress getting moved into the warehouse was and what how much yeah. stress it relieved for me. Yep. So, um, we will end the video here. Um, we love you guys. Thanks for coming along. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, head over to NorfordSouth.com and push that little bell notification thing so that you can come back for, well, which is today's vlog, where we put in the open shelving in the kitchen and get that, get that room finished up. Talk to you later. Bye. Bye.